Hey guys, it's Rock Jr. here, and today we're doing a bit of a different video. Today I'm reacting to my first ever performance live on a stage with my good friend Yon. Uh, he's a brother to me, and if you guys don't know yet, I have a band channel. Me, him, and my other brother Francisco, we play music together. Um, so this was our first performance. Francisco was out with his mom on, like, I think the Honduras. They were just doing some family business and stuff. So it was me and Jan, and we were, it was a winter festival, and so we played some Christmas songs early on, but then we had our own song. I was gonna go up on my own, but I wanted something else with me so I wasn't all alone. So I'm like, no, Jan, why don't you play the song with me? We figured it out in like less than a week. And this is what we came up with. It wasn't the best, I'll be honest. It was pretty choppy, pretty bad. And we were nervous as heck. But it definitely helped us just with performing and going on a stage. And no one really booed us. There's like one kid that like critiqued John strumming. But, I mean, yeah, we're beginners and stuff, you know. But anyways, let's get into the video. Enough talking. I'm gonna get my headphones on. So yeah, Nothing Else Matters by Metallica. So that, that was alright. The thing that bothers me is so when I got up there, I think someone was like messing with my guitar behind stage or something. Like like before I got up there. Because my string got out to my G string on the guitar. And, um, you know, maybe someone didn't touch it. But, you know, sometimes they go out of tune by themselves. But yeah, it was out of tune. And the whole time I kept hearing it as bad. But people started liking it. And someone critiqued John on his timing, and I guess I kind of see that now. But the only reason I see it is because of how much he's improved since this. This was seven months ago, about seven or eight. Okay, so I don't know if you saw, but I looked at him, and I looked at him a few times, and I, I was in my mind, like, I'm looking at him, like, I don't know, just to interact with him, just, like, to just show that we're working together in this song, I was, like, trying to be, like, yeah, I'm here, too, we're, we're not alone, but after, he told me that he was so scared every time I looked at him, because he thought that, I was looking at him like, what are you doing? Like, he thought he was playing it wrong or something. But no, I was actually proud of him. I was happy we were up there. But yeah, he told me after the show, he's like, yeah, I was so scared. I thought you were looking at me like I was doing something wrong. All right, I just went back a little bit. So let's try it. <laughs> I don't know if you just saw someone walk behind me. They were cleaning up, uh, like, all the instruments and stuff. Because I think there's people dancing or something next. I forgot. I forgot the order of it. I thought, I'm pretty sure we were the last. Yeah, they were all cleaning up. And um, it was really annoying because the curtain kept hitting me. Like, we wanted the whole stage just to ourselves. And they're like, okay, we're going to close the curtains. You guys stand outside and play. And... I was like on the edge, like my feet were poking out like on the on the edge of the stage. So yeah, and then they kept running past me and I was scared that they were going to step on the cord or like brush it, brush against it and then fall off my guitar and ruin the whole thing. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, so the reason I kept looking at him there a lot is before the show, he wanted to know when I was going to stop and do my solo. Because we didn't have long to like talk about like all of the progressions and stuff. So I'll just keep playing until you tell me to finish it off. And because at the end, I was like, I was contemplating doing a solo the whole time because I practiced it. And recently I did a cover on this channel. Go check that out. But uh, after I did that cover, I started learning the solo. And I was really contemplating it because I wanted to give something good for the audience. But I was also scared I'd choke a bit. Here's how it went. <laughs> they all started clapping and I wasn't even done yet. So that almost threw me off guard. I was going to just finish it there. But then I just started ripping it. Not really. It was, it was an easy solo. Oh my god. I don't know why it keeps freezing. <laughs> it was so funny because Jan was just sitting there watching me. But yeah, that's, that was my first performance as a guitarist. I used to sing for a choir, but that was my first time playing live for an audience with a guitar. And we didn't sound great at all, but these people, they loved it. You know, if I was playing this in front of a bunch of other musicians, ah, oh man, that'd be so bad. I wouldn't even go on stage. But yeah, that was good. I had a great time with Jan. We had a great night that night. It was it was really fun. And uh, shout out to my friend Miguel for recording this video. My parents also recorded it. But Miguel sent his footage to me a long, long time ago. Like the next day after. And uh, I meant to do a video like this before. But I uh, just kind of forgot about it. Um, but anyways, guys, that's it. Uh, if you want me to like upload the whole video so you can watch it yourself, I might upload it on my band channel. Just let me down know down below. And that's about it. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next video, whatever I upload. And um, have a great day.